Welcome back to Midday Kentucky, everyone. I'm here with Karen Hogan, and she is the owner, designer, seamstress for Tidy Diners. Super cute products. I can't wait to talk with you about this. Welcome to the show. Thank you so much for having me. Now, let me ask you all of these little I mean, she has items that are for children, for infants, for animals, for your dog. They are so cute. How did you come up with this idea, first of all, first well, of all for your it store? It started with uh, my own uh, mom making bibs for, my grand, for my, her grandchildren, for my kids. And uh, when my grandchildren came along, I decided, oh, I'm going to try the same thing. I just adjusted the pattern slightly yeah. and changed the materials a little bit. And uh, that's kind of what started. My kids were asking for gifts as for their friends that were having babies. Mm -hmm. and. Uh, then I said, oh, maybe I can try and sell some of this. Oh, so. my goodness. Well, <laughs> they are super cute. Thank you. Very well made. The materials, I love the terry on the All back. Cotton. I mean, oh, it's just so adorable. All cotton. And so how did it go from that point then, from just well, making some on your own to yeah, all of a sudden? I did, I did a few of the craft shows, little church craft shows at the holiday time. Mm -hmm. And then I read an article about uh, Mindy Rohr, the girl who does the Love Lexington blog, and she does Market Free one, which she started. Um, for makers, for artists, for people to sell their stuff uh -huh. downtown in Lexington like once a month. And it's a really fun atmosphere. It's at Manchester Music Hall. Yeah. And uh, so I, I put an application in with pictures and she said, oh yes, you can, you're in. So it kind of went from there. Oh wow. And yeah. how has it changed your business getting, you know, it, I mean yeah. I'm sure it's been moving pretty yeah. rapidly it for you. It went from so. baby bibs, it uh -huh. went from just bibs to People asking for blankets and people asking for gift sets with the burp pad and mm -hmm. the bib. And then a customer bought a bib and she's, um, she happened to be the marketing director at Incredipet, which is now Feeder Supply. Right. And she asked me, she said, I think you could make some you know, bandanas for us to sell and bow ties. And so that's how this took off. Wow. Well, let's, let's look at some of the items that you have and show everyone Sear our viewers. Sucker They're is so best cute. Yeah. I mean, they really are. Here's just a few examples, and we've got, I mean, you've Madras. got, mat yeah, you have the Madras, you have, um, you have all kinds of, you had the seersucker yeah, with have. the little whales, it was so cute, I have to yeah, find it. That's a very that popular. Is that not adorable? And every, <laughs> everything can be monogrammed. I do monogramming on the spot when we're at Market 301. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah, so and, that's and really. And I'm, you do it right on the spot. How long does it take to do the monogram? Um, sometimes we get backed up, but if it's just a name, it's like five or ten minutes. Okay. I mean, I can keep it going pretty quickly if the people come to me first early. Wow, that, that Otherwise, is Otherwise, awesome. it gets backed up a little bit. Oh, <laughs> sure. Uh, and the blankets, look how cute is this. I mean, it's so soft, too. It and they're 100% really cotton on that side and then fleece on this. And it's great yep. reversible. You could, you know, in the summer use the cotton side and the winter use the other side. And it's a good size for like a car seat or a crib uh -huh. or, you know, small. And what are these little gift packets here? That I see. is a bib and a burp cloth. That's a great set to give oh. somebody for a baby shower. Yeah. And I kind of do neutral colors. If you don't know the sex, I have yellow and I also have gray. Awesome. I do them in all the same, all the same, you know, fabrics. You don't have to just get seersucker. Mm-hmm. And what I love, too, is that you have the dog products, too. And that is so popular right now. Yes, um, very popular. Now, these, these are the, like the little bandanas, right? Mm -hmm. That they yep. wear on their neck. Yeah, and they're, they're all so reversible. Cute. I you have can, to show this. Yeah, I kind of got that. This is like a little take on the, since we're, we are, have a horse farm, this is kind of a little take on the snap and the Super ring cute. for that. Super cute. Oh, my and goodness. And they're all reversible. And these, these are the little um, dog collars. And I did this with a little bit of the steel stuff as well. And this is just a collar with a slide-on bow tie, uh -huh. and that again is for the dog. And now we start to have people asking me for if you could do dog, you know, a dog bow tie that matched for the child, so I did clip-ons for the kids. Is and that not the cutest thing in the world? So I love that. Both. Having the matching bow tie with, the, uh, with yeah. the child and the dog, I think that's really cute. And you also have, now these are aprons for right. little guys that's and girls, right. right? Yeah, everybody wants to cook with grandma or mom, and <laughs> yeah. So cute. And I, I usually do the name for yeah. the kids across the Right do here. the monogramming right Very there. Very popular gift, and some people Very like cute. them as party favors yeah. for little girls. Where do people find your products? Uh, well, I have a website. It's uh, www.tidydiners.com, uh -huh. and then also at Market 301, okay. and um, that's once a month. And I also have uh, a pop-up shop this Sunday okay. at uh, the Pottery Barn at the Summit at Fritz Farm from 12 to 6. Now what are, yeah, so what is a pop-up shop? Explain That's where what I that will is. just bring all my stuff and And you're going to be right there in Pottery That's Barn. That's right. Yeah. Okay, I'll so be people there can the find time. you there then. Mm -hmm. Okay, mm -hmm. very good. And you also do custom work, right? I do. Yeah, I did uh, originally just got a request from uh, La Petite Delicat, the little macaron shop. Yes. 
and I did uh, aprons for her Good. place, and that's how these came about, my own design. Awesome. And Beautiful work, thank beautiful so work. Much. We love it. Um, uh, thank you for coming on the show, thank too. Thank you by for the way. having me. You're welcome. And also, uh, coming up we, after this break, we have a little bit more information for you about this and that going on at our studio. So keep it right here. You are with Midday Kentucky, everyone.